Hey everybody, I'm Trish Wachowski from FoldFactor.com and I'm here in Boston, Mass at Standard Finishing Systems uh, National Demonstration and Training Center. I'm here with George Virgilis, uh, their Director of Sales, and George is going to take me through uh, several demonstrations of their various finishing technologies. I can't wait. I'm looking forward to it, Trish. All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay, Trish, we've uh, transitioned the automated folder from a standalone folder in line now to uh, a Humpler cutter okay. and winder plow folder. And the way we did that was uh, putting in our uh, digital interface, which is not only mechanically connected, it's also communicating downstream with the, uh, the Humpler product. Wow, and that changeover was really quick. Less, mm. less than 10 minutes. Wow. Very simple changeover. That's amazing. Well, I'm going to have to ask you here, I see a couple of logos. I see Horizon and Hunkler, um, obviously combining two technologies here. Can you explain a little bit about that relationship? Sure. You know, we've, we've had a long, long relationship with both Horizon and with Hunkler. Uh -huh. And over the years, had the ability to bring the, 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 the best of the manufacturing engineers together yeah. uh, to create devices like the digital interface wow. uh, to connect our products to Hunkler products. Well, a lot of this is new to me. So can you kind of walk me through the what, what we have here and kind of the workflow? Sure. This is a uh, Hunkler unwinder okay. that would take a pre-printed roll. Then we're going to bring it through a plow folder. And a plow folder is primarily used in the direct mail industry because it has a lot of flexibility, allowing for very, very quick changeover from job to job. And is that, it looks like it's scoring yeah, too. We're, uh, we're scoring and then folding, bringing uh -huh. it through the plow fold into the Hunter cutter where we're using a, uh, a double cutter. So we're, we're, we're creating a chip out so that we're bleeding to the image. Transitioning that, uh, that cut sheet now uh -huh. through the digital interface. And George, can I ask you a little bit about flexibility? I, I noticed we've got a, 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 a roll mounted there. Is there some flexibility in the width as yes. well? Yes, this will go up to a 20 and a half inch roll. Okay. Going. As you can see, Chris, we're running at about uh, 22,000 an hour. And the job that we're producing is a half to a letter fold. Okay, so pretty... Uh, we can also okay. put in uh, edge trimmers to create two-up nested. Yep. Uh, we can do gutter cutting. Uh, we, could, we, we could do two-up letter folding at somewhere in the neighborhood of 80,000 an hour. Wow. Coming out of it. So really the... The configurations are endless. Absolutely. So your customers must be seeing some pretty exciting results. Yeah, it's one thing to see it here in the demonstration floor, but to get into an environment where a customer is producing just volumes of work on a daily basis, watching the transition from job to job, using the, uh, the, the memory capabilities on both of the products, yeah. storing these jobs in memory. And right, how many? Ability. It was like 200 Up or something. 200 uh, on the Stored folder. jobs, yeah. that's amazing. All different fold configuration. Wow, well this has been an eye-opening demonstration. Thanks, George, so much for sharing this with us today. You're very welcome and come again, Trish. Oh, I will. Thank <laughs> Thanks. You.